A high-tech chip plant coming to the Albany area grabbed headlines around the business world this week. AMD's announcement could have some impact here in the Rochester area. Our new Seth Voorhees has the story. Our program really focuses on the uh, process technology in manufacturing of microchips. RIT's microelectronic engineering program has a reputation for grooming those who work in such high-tech jobs. Our students are, are always in demand. They could be even more so now. A state-backed deal could allow advanced micro devices and investors from Abu Dhabi to build a microprocessor plant near Albany employing 1,500. It's good to have high technology jobs coming into the state. Jobs that could potentially be filled by RIT students. Several already work for IBM in the Capital District. Some others work for AMD in other places. If you like the area, it's good to have options. You know, IBM was always a big draw for the people in this program. I know there's a lot of people from here that have gone to IBM, and I would imagine that AMD is going to be kind of the same thing. It's going to be very good for the state of New York to keep high-tech jobs upstate. And these kind of facilities always bring up more facilities to go with them, which keeps our graduates here. While the jobs and the investment are seen as good news to those in the technology fields, the ADM announcement has even greater significance here on the RIT campus. They're one of the longtime affiliates uh, that have supported our department since the very beginning. RIT has a long-standing partnership with AMD, which includes financial support, equipment donation, and input on curriculum. Professor Carl Hirschman says the program will benefit, so will students. This will provide additional options to stay, to stay local, um, and on slow years, it will definitely have an impact on the hiring of our students. Leaders say the AMD deal could make New York a major player in microprocessing home cooking in a field that always seems to have job demand somewhere else. This is pretty significant. Seth Voorhees, R News.